we are all here first of all representing a movie so we should not try and say anybody is representing a state i think we're all trying to represent the film uh, and represent freedom of expression i think everybody here supports that i'm honestly completely unaware about what you're stating we're actually here feeling very proud and very happy about what has happened yesterday and i think uh, the honorable bench has given a decision which i have huge respect for i actually even appreciate the one cut that they have given i appreciate it although from a personal point of view i would have wanted this film to pass without any cuts and the shot that has been cut is mine uh, but from a from a uh, you know from a neutral point of view i think uh, what we need to learn from what has been said is that we have the freedom to express ourselves but we need to be responsible uh, so i think that's a very nice balance and it was a very 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 nice decision that was taken and uh, to me that is definitive of the question that was raised with the film Murta Punjab and to me the issue should end there and I'm unaware of what you have spoken about so I can't comment on it and we're sitting here saying that we're releasing on the 17th of June uh, which goes to show that we are moving forward after what has happened yesterday. <laughs> बट मैं एक गल तो जरूर कहना चाहना थोड़े सारे का थैंक्स मैं आम बॉम्बे फिल्म इंडस्ट्री तो नहीं हाँ बट जिदा फिल्म इंडस्ट्री ने सारे ने सपोर्ट की मीडिया ने सपोर्ट की वो तुम सारे बधाई दे हकदार हो तुम सारे ने बहुत सपोर्ट की और अभी सा सारी टीम थोड़े सारे का थैंक्स करना ही स्पैशली बट आरम नो जी गल की आरम नो बहुत हेलो हाई one of the ministers in the punjab government he was quoted saying that uh, in the trailer you had shown that uh, shahid kapoor's character say that 70% of the youth uh, in punjab is uh, into drugs so that is what uh, you know has started is what i wanted to know from you was the 70% like is this uh, you taken a creative liberty or uh, is it based on your research uh, it's a it's a point of view uh, that uh, was expressed uh, by a character in the film it was that character's point of view um uh, i i stand by uh, the data that the government and aims has provided regarding this matter uh, in the film the context was that it was a particular character's point of view and since then we have taken note of the fact that uh, people might take umbrage to it and we rectified it uh, alia and shahid harani rana from times now the directors and the filmmakers have spoken about the sensor board and the sensibilities of, as actors what do you reckon about the uh, uh, sort of uh, the cuts that were proposed, the Bombay High Court order, and do you reckon that uh, there needs to be a revamp of the censor board? Um, first of all, anybody who was speaking uh, from our behalf was representing the entire team. And uh, a lot of times when actors come in the forefront, the issue gets skirted, you know, because the focus becomes about some one word that the actor said or some one line that the actor said. And so it was a team decision for certain individuals who will be able to represent this issue the best. I think me and Alia are still new to this whole censorship issue. Uh, there are a lot more people who have had to deal with it for a longer period of time. And there were people who were far more experienced and probably had had to go through this struggle many times before. And they were a lot more uh, evolved. Uh, having said that, Mr. Kashyap has just arrived. Uh, they were a lot more evolved uh, and had a much larger understanding of this issue. Um, so we chose to do it in a way which would be as balanced as possible and I think the representation was not from a point of view of what will get more, uh, you know, headlines, but it was who will speak better and who will represent the film better. And I think uh, I have to thank Anurag for doing that and uh, really uh, taking it upon himself at a time when he has a film releasing, I think just one week after Urta Punjab, Raman Raghav. And uh, it's a very busy time for a filmmaker. And I think it was very, very selfless on his part. And I want to remind people about the fact that, you know, one month before the release of a film is an unbelievably tiring, stressful, scary time for the entire team. People are running from one end to, an to another just to get the film ready in time, to book your uh, theatres in time, to make sure that your mixing happens, to make sure that your dubbing is done, to make sure that your promos are running in time, to make sure that you're being able to promote the film correctly, people are aware of it. And at such a time to deal with this kind of a situation is extremely difficult. And we really couldn't have done it without the kind of absolute uh, relentlessness that Anurag put towards the cause. And he really took it upon himself. And everybody else probably was able to go out there and do what they needed to do because of him. Um, having said that, I think I have complete... Sir, I'll finish it. 
मंत्र में आपका भी I have, I have, I have complete respect for uh, the judgment that happened yesterday. I think it was an amazing judgment, and I think it has provided insight to people on both sides as to how we need to move forward. And uh, so, I would say that I would probably agree with everything that the judgment says. But going back to the question, you as actors individually, do you reckon Censor Board needs a revamp? Alia, if you can take See, that. See, I, I just want to say something very simply. I completely agree with Shahid that whatever. Communication that was happening on the on the team's uh, front was all a team thought, effort, emotion, everything. We all were in this together. But yes, we chose to not say too much because things can be misinterpreted. But I can give you a very personal and maybe a little bit of a naive response that maybe I had when I heard about um, the the cuts that were suggested. My first question was to my father, but why, and how? But it does not make sense. I was not able to understand. And my father, as Shahid mentioned, there have been people who have fought this and been way mature. My father has been fighting this since the longest time. And he looked at me in a way that, Alia, it is, it is something that happens. But go to the court, fight it, and you will be, you will come out feeling very, um, feeling happy because they will always be on your side. And he was very sure about that. Coming back to again the statement that Shahid made, that I am. You don't know how happy I was yesterday when I got that SMS that we have passed Urta Punjab with a certificate with one cut. I was so delighted, and that just shows that um, eventually you may have to fight for things that you believe in. But um, the with the judiciary and the court and the uh, and the judges, we just we we did what we wanted to do, and I feel so happy because I'm a director's daughter, and to know the fact that what a director has to go through when you're saying that ye nikalo, wo nikalo, ye nikalo, wo nikalo, it's like you can't, you don't, you don't understand. The feeling is like your intestines, everything goes all turning all over. So I'm just really happy that we've reached this stage, and yeah, now we can just smile and have the film release. Anurag ji. All right, uh, this is yeah, Krishna here from ET now. One question to Ekta and one question to Anurag. Uh, Ekta, uh, ma'am.